Hi guys, I'm Rick. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making an apricot glazed pork roast in my Ronco Showtime rotisserie oven. Alright, I'm starting out here. I have roughly a three pound pork roast. This is boneless and I have it loaded on a spit rod to my Ronco Showtime rotisserie oven. And I have uh, some apricot preserves here. This is like to put on bread. This is roughly about a half a cup. I put it in the microwave and I warmed it up to make it more uh, runny so it'll spread on it smoother. So I'm just going to go ahead and spread this all over my pork roast. And this here is a pretty straightforward and simple recipe. Uh, there's really not too much to it. So I'm going to go ahead and get my pork roast nice and covered. And I have uh, a mat under here to catch the dripping so I don't get my stove all messy. Alright, this over here to hold this. It's going to roll that way. And I'm just going to spread this all over. Nice and even. And what this will do in the uh, rotisserie oven is as it bakes, it will caramelize on there and it should make a nice crust. Down this side here. Let me go ahead and make him just scoop up the uh, drippings and get them back on there. Alright. I'm just going to add some rosemary on this. And that's all I'm going to season this with. Just a little bit here and there. Okay, that should be good. Alright, let's go ahead and get this loaded into the oven. Okay, I'm going to load this back in now. And I have a uh, piece of foil on the bottom of my oven here to catch the worst of that there. Uh, apricot preserves so it doesn't make a total mess of my oven for easier cleanup. Alright now I have my roast in. I'm going to set this for a half hour because this isn't a very big roast. Then in a half hour I'll check it with the meat thermometer for temperature and then we'll be back. So I'm going to go ahead and plug this in. Alright my pork roast went for the half hour and I checked it for temperature. It was only at like 130 so I gave it 10 more minutes and I'm checking it for temperature again. And when I checked it at the half hour point, I went with more of that apricot preserves and I glazed it some more. So I have the thermometer in here checking the temperature. And the beauty of this foil on the bottom is when I'm done cooking, just pull that out, throw it in the trash, the oven's clean other than the spit rod. So let's check the temperature on that. Now that says 135, but I have a feeling it's higher than that. Let's go down in there deep. All right, my roast is reading 177. That's more than done. I don't know if you can see that or not. Now it's dropping. I'm going to get that out of there. I'm going to let it rest for about 10 minutes, and then we'll cut into it. All right, I let my pork roast rest for about 10 minutes. Let's go ahead and cut into it. And it has a nice uh, crust on the outside of the bark. You can see all that juice on the bottom of the uh, plate there. And it looks nice and juicy and has a sweet smell to it. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, fix up a plate and see what we got. I also went ahead and I made some fried potatoes and some peas run aside. So there you have it. Apricot glazed pork roast in my Ronco Showtime rotisserie oven. Give this a try. I think you'll like it. And until next time, I'll see you.